Hello YouTube, this is Aman Tuman from Techies365. In this video tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how to set up Google Workspace Dual Delivery. What is Dual Delivery? So, in case you like to have secondary mail server along with your primary mail server, and you like to have a copy of your primary mail server into the secondary mail server, in that case, you need Dual Delivery. In an element word, it's like, some organization needs some kind of archival system. Let's just say if you have Google Workspace running primary MX in your domain and you like to have a copy of copy of all of your domain in your on-premises mail server, in such case you have to set up dual delivery on your Gmail server. So in in our case, uh, we're gonna use Zoho as our secondary or archival mail system. So we have to set up dual delivery in our Google Workspace. To demonstrate, uh, we're currently using Google Workspace in our domain as a primary MX. As you can see, the lowest priority is the FX, uh, sorry, the Google Mail, Mail Server, which is lowest priority here. And uh, we're gonna set up, also we have um, our domain email box set up in our Zoho Mail, which is in here, as you can see, we have one user created, which is admin telecaremedicine.com. So now we're gonna create a dual delivery for that mailbox user. So straight to the Google, uh, you also have Google user, Google Workspace user for that mail that mailbox. And now we're gonna create a host to set up dual delivery system. Here we're gonna create new routes. And we're gonna give it name so mail, and it's multiple host, and uh, their MX is MX one. Sorry, that's uh, MX twenty five, and we're gonna give it low fifty percent. The second one is MX two zoho dot twenty five, low forty percent, and we're gonna use MX three. Or 25 load 10 percent so overall load is 100 percent so if you have single mail server make sure you select single mail server and since we have multi host that's why we select multi host and they don't use 468 because that's what google restricted so you can use 425 or 568 as a mail port and uh, since my mail server support TLS, that's why I selected all of them. If your mail server don't have that support, make sure you uncheck that. And if you like to verify the connection, make sure you click on test connection and before save. You click on save. Now we go back to the settings for Gmail and we're gonna configure the dual delivery now. Scroll down to the advanced settings. Scroll down to the routing section. Then we're gonna configure routing. So well, let's give its name dual daily delivery inbound to Zoho. You can name it whatever you want. Let's click everything. Inbound, outbound, internal sending, internal receiving. And then this is the fun part in here. So you have to select the envelope filter, which is uh, for my case, since I have only one mailbox, which is this one, so I'm gonna select only single mailbox. So I'm gonna just copy paste in here. But if you have a number of people, then you can put them in a group and you can select the group membership. Or if you like to do for whole domain, in such case, you can do pattern match. Since I have only one user, so I'm gonna select only that one. Now, for the action part, we're gonna select modify message and we're gonna just click on this one, add XGM original to header. And then we're gonna select also deliver to more recipient. Click add and click on advanced and change group to the Zoho mail. And you can check this. Uh, if you like to deliver the spam, you, you can uncheck this. So that's fine for me. I don't like to deliver spam. 
and then uh, just check this one same as the above the one we selected add gm as original to header click save and show option you're gonna select user since i selected single user that's why i'm gonna select if you use the group section you're gonna group use and if you use pattern you're gonna select catch all go we'll add settings so we configured for delivery for dual inbound we're gonna create another another one add another let's give it a name outbound outbound to zero we're gonna replicate the same rules just for outbound so here also delivery to and advance change route to zone mail add hex gm to origin header save users saved now click on save once everything is okay so that's gonna set up our dual delivery now we're gonna test our dual delivery so from a general mail which is a gmail account i'm gonna send a mail to uh, that mailbox which is admin at telecommedicine.com let's give us a name confirm if you will receive okay click on send then we're gonna check our mailbox both mailbox here so we're gonna wait one minute in here so we got the mail in google workspace already now okay we got the secondary mail secondary mail on google uh, sorry good zoho work uh, zoho mail so uh, this is how we're gonna configure our mails dual delivery system if you have any question you can put it in comment section we try to reply your comment and if you don't subscribe if you already don't subscribe the channel please make sure you subscribe our channel and thanks for watching this video